Hi, in this video we'll go through our uh, Excel sheet how to create time schedule and cash flow using Excel and uh, specifically using this Excel sheet. In this Excel sheet we have three workbooks. The first one is the pie chart, second one is the cash flow, third one is the data. Party chart here we have the target plan, actual forecast, and the variance between two of them. We have here some, uh, uh, this is a bar chart area. Uh, we have here some color coding. This color means this is a baseline or the plan dates. This color means is actual work done already. This color means is the remaining work. And this color means holiday and weekend. First thing you have to do to start using this Excel sheet, you go to the data. And you identify here your holidays because this sheet based on working days a calculation. So just identify here your holidays and choose here which weekend is off in your schedule. Whether you can choose Friday, Thursday, one day per week, or you can choose two days. So for example, if we choose Friday here and we go to the part chart, we'll find this is the Friday column already picked up with the color of the holiday and in addition to these two days we identified as a holiday here. If we choose two days per week we'll find the pie chart here showing two days, two days, two days per week as a holiday. So let's go to make it Friday the weekend. And let's see how it's work. First thing you have to identify your data date is very important. So our data date here is 15 November. So in the 15 November, which is this, before 15 November will be actual work, and after 15 November will be the remaining work. Let's do one activity. Let's call it activity three. number 3 whose budget cost 100,000 or 1 million sorry the start date let's say 1st November 2012 the plan finish will be 25 December 2012 automatically here the duration working days will be calculated the planned value will be calculated the planned percentage as of the last date will be calculated this is based remember this is based on your choose here how many days you are working on friday as a weekend and two holidays here okay in the actual part we will put here actual forecast start Let's say it start in the same plan date, 1st November. Don't put the actual finish if it is not completed 100%. Let's say it is completed by 20%. Just put 20% here and everything will be calculated. If you are not satisfying with, with any value of this, you can change it easily and uh, do not affect the cash flow. Here, this is representing the actual and this one representing the remaining one and it is all fully automated let's say if we finish this one by 100% in that case you have to put your uh, 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 completion date, actual finish date by yourself and remember this one cannot be after this date so let's say it is 14 November 14 November and it will give you the actual values. This will be, will, be, will be reflected automatically and will draw your cash flow. And you can at any time you can change here to seven days to whatever for a day and everything will be recalculated automatically. This variance is a variance between the plan and the actual in days 
and in cost and in percentage. This is the revision one or revision uh, point one of the, the of this Excel sheet. So please, if you find any bug, just inform me and let's make it work together. Thank you very much.